that better? That's better, isn't it? Yeah. Hey, <laughs> <laughs> Hiya, Matt. Right, I've read your um your uh, uh, query online, saying yeah. the fact that you filled the boiler up, but since you've done that, the water shut off. Can you just show me the front of the boiler and what boiler you've got, please? Yeah, hang on, let me just turn. Right, okay. so it's a logic. Okay, fantastic. Right, um, can you show me underneath the boiler, please, where you filled it up from? <clears throat> so the filling loop. You see the two. Right. You see the yeah, second one, right? Matt, it's very, very simple. The one on the right-hand side, the furthest blue handle, yeah. turn that switch in line. Yeah. And it, that's, uh, t- uh, t- sorry, turn that one back off. And then turn the, o- the other one, the, the second one, down. Down, it only goes up. Oh, up no, well, down, turn it up yeah. then. Right, okay. down. Now go to a hot water tap and try and turn the tap on for me. Hey. There you go. Very simply, what you've done there, Matt, <laughs> when you what, yeah. listen, when you fill the um the boiler up with an integral filling loop, it yeah. will shut the supply going to hot taps. So you fifty percent of the job you've done. You you topped it up, okay? Um yeah. it, it it filled up, but then what you hadn't done is you hadn't put the handle back on to allow the flow of water, okay, into the uh, into the boiler. But there you go, all well done. I knew, I knew it was something simple because I was, I was messing around with it and I thought, okay, and I, I made sure to turn everything back the same way. And then I, I filled it up, repressurized it, and I thought, I've definitely put this back the right way, but obviously I haven't. That's why I just it's, it's, it's a simple thing to do. It's a simple thing to do, mate. That's why this service is so good, you see. So I'd have had to pay someone to come out and... Well, that that would have been a hundred pound call. That would have been. Do it all for me. Matt, where where did you find us out of interest? I just looked on Google. I just, to be honest, I knew it was something that I'd messed up probably. Okay. So I just sort of typed in FaceTime plumber, um, okay. or FaceTime heating engineer, and it came up. So perfect. You know, honestly, because I, the things with the boiler, you try and do it yourself, and if you don't put the cat, you know the. the Leave it back the right way, which I knew I'd done something wrong. Do you know what? It's a very simple thing. I've had heating engineers do the same thing over the years. It's, it, reading your report, what they come through, I had an idea it would be that. Um, I mean, there's certain things you can touch on board and certain things you can't. That's one of the yeah, things you can touch. So, so it's a very simple fix. Like I say, save yourself quite a bit of money there. And uh, yeah, yeah, more than able to do it. Any other okay. issues? Plumbing, heating, give us a call. And, uh, I will. There you go. You're, you're today's hero. Well done, mate. Thanks, mate. No, thanks very much. Appreciate your help. Take care. Thank you. Bye. Bye. Bye.